Hello, this is Fee Taylor. Today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about portion control for kids. Too often I see overpacked lunch boxes, combine that with the upsizing of all the meals at all the takeaway joints. Large serving sizes at restaurants on kids' menus, and generally in the home. Kids are actually eating a lot more food than they should, being generic here of course, but I often see it. And so I want to talk to you today about what is the right serving size for children. Unfortunately, the lack of education for parents and combined with the sedentary lifestyles that our children tend to lead these days in front of video machines and Game Boys, etc., are causing our e epidemic of youth, diabetes and obesity. I'm going to read you a statistic which might surprise you. In 2008, the Australian Bureau of Statistics released a study that showed that a quarter of all Australian children, or approximately 600,000 children between the ages of 5 and 17, were overweight or obese. The same study from the Australian Bureau of Statistics also showed that very few children eat enough fruit and vegetables. Almost three children in every five don't eat enough fruit, and less than one in five can sh not, does not consume enough vegetables. And that's pretty amazing. As parents and caregivers, we must take more control over the diet and the food intake. And not only is quality important, but the quantity. And that's what I want to talk to you about now. Less is more. And I feel from personal experience, it's better to serve the child a smallest meal, and then if they're still hungry, they can ask for more. As long as their nutritional requirements are being met, there's no need for them to overeat. The more food you place on the plate, the more food they'll tend to eat. And they'll get used to and accustomed to having a lot of food on their plate and consuming the same. Every day a child should have two serves of fruit. And the serve equates to approximately 200 kilojoules or 50 calories. But without a nutritional label on fruit, how do you know what that is? A serve of fruit containing 50 calories could be one of the following, one of the following. Either two thirds cup of grapes with the stalks on, one kiwi fruit, approximately half a cup of mango, one small orange, one 20 ml thick fresh piece of pineapple, a ring, one, or one and three quarter cups of strawberries, two, yes only two pieces of dried apple, or one tablespoon of sultanas, which of course is far less than the average box of sultanas contains. Those items make up one serve, so if picking two of those is enough for your child's fruit intake for, for the day. Let me now give you some examples of serves of protein. So protein is made up from meat, poultry, fish, seafood, eggs, legumes or other vegetarian alternatives. A serve is approximately 400 kilojoules or 95 calories and this can equate to one of the following. Again let me read these to you. One chicken leg with no skin. Two chicken nuggets equals one serve of protein. Two lamb chops, of course fat cut off. Half, yes only half of a grilled or barbecued snack. One small piece of fish. 2 calamari rings, 10 medium prawns, a small can of tuna, 1.5 medium sized eggs, half a cup of chickpeas or 4 cubes, approximately 3 centimetres square of tofu. Kids need approximately 3 serves of protein each day. So taking examples from that list, they could have, for example, at breakfast time, 1.5 eggs, scrambled makes it easier when you're doing the half. They could have maybe a couple of lamb chops with some veggies at lunchtime and a chicken leg at dinner time. And there is their protein served for the day. As for milk, kids need a range of between 3 and 6 serves, approximately 95 calories or 400 kilojoules of dairy depending on their age. Younger children from 2 up, 2 to 3, generally three servings, and as they reach adolescence, six servings for those growing bones. And what about dairy products? Children need a range of three to six serves of dairy per day, depending on their age. 
A serve again is about 400 kilojoules or 95 calories. A serve can equate to one of the following. 140 mils of full cream milk or soy milk, a 100 gram snack size yogurt, one and a half cheese sticks, a third of a cup of custard, or five small cubes of cheese. So as you can see, dairy is very important for our growing children, but serving sizes are probably far less than you would actually think they are. Most kids go and have a glass of milk and it usually equates to about a cup. So if you're using 250 mils as a guideline, as, as your cup, then obviously they've just had two serves of dairy for the day. A lot of children do overdose on yogurt and dairy products and whilst parents think this is a great uh, item to be giving their kids because it's healthy and it's natural, again, overfeeding your children of these particular nutrients is not doing them any good at all. So please take consideration when you're preparing your children's food and look at the, servings, the serving sizes that you're giving them. If you'd like more information, feel free to contact me through Toddlers to Teens TV show and I can give you some more reference material and some other statistics if you are interested. Thanks again. Have a great day.